Let's talk about how to create files, which can be used in emulation, with no optical drive, or to create CDRs that can be used on a PlayStation console. Choose the region in the dropdown for the version of the game you're playing. In the Make a Monster app for Monster Rancher 2, let's pick the main breed and sub-breed of the monster we want to create. You can observe any monster's attributes to help you decide. Next, we will choose the file type we want to create, which can be used by certain programs. If you're going to burn a CD, choose the top selection with image burn. However, for this demonstration, we're using the DuckStation emulator. If desired, you can adjust the starting stats of a monster by changing the offset indices. A table of the index values can be found below the custom stats table, so you can see what each index value gives. Note, some monsters are fully hard-coded and can't have these values adjusted. Each index value is summed, then added to, or subtracted from, the monster's base stats. Here we have chosen two index values that provide an additional 40 weeks of lifespan to the baseline. Click Generate Files once the file type, program, and index values are finalized. Next, download both files that were generated and save them to the same folder. You can also right-click and Save As to choose a specific location to save them to. Once both files have been confirmed saved, you're ready to shrine your new monster. If you downloaded the files for image burn, then this is where you would burn the CD from the created files. For emulation, you will not need a CD. Simply go to the shrine. When prompted to insert a CD, click Change Disk, then choose From File. Of the file pair that was downloaded, point to the smaller text file. If you point to the larger but empty data file, you won't get the desired result. When prompted to reinsert the game disk, click on Change Disk, then point back to your game from the game file or game list. We can compare the predicted starting stats from Make a Monster for accuracy. With third-party tools such as Lexi's Advanced Viewer, we can validate the starting lifespan as well. Click the Random Monster button to pick a random monster for you. If you want to be completely surprised, check the Hide Monster Name box. This will obscure the monster type from the downloaded file name, along with a number. With hidden monster names, each time you generate the files and click a new random monster, the monster file names will increment automatically, so you don't have to rename them manually when saving them. Make a Monster can create every possible monster and stat offset combination, totaling over 609,000 variations.